Ooh, it's the cat's meow. In fact, it's 26 facts about cats that'll make you love them. Even if you're a dog lover? Well, maybe. Did you know that every culture has its own word for the sound a cat makes? In English, cats say meow, kitties in Korea say meowng, and a cat in Turkey will greet you with meowv. Obviously, the whole world is obsessed with these adorable furry creatures. So why not brush up on your cat facts? Some of them will definitely surprise you. Before we pay homage to the feline, be sure to click that subscribe button and ring the notification bell to join us on the bright side. Number 1. The Mesopotamians and ancient Egyptians were the first to domesticate cats. Since these cultures were dependent on agriculture, the enemies of their livelihood were the animals that ate their crops. It's speculated that once they finally figured out that wild cats preyed on these creatures, they fed the cats to keep them around, and this is how they slowly became domesticated. Number 2. When their pets died, Egyptian cat owners would not only mummify their beloved friends along with some mummified mice for their journey through the afterlife, but also shave off their eyebrows as a sign of mourning. Once their brows grew back, the period of mourning was over. Yeah, we're talking about the cat owner's eyebrows, not actually shaving the dead cats. That would be weird. Number 3. Now, since the Egyptians thought of cats so highly, they accessorized their pets with jewels. The richer and more aristocratic the owner, the bigger the jeweled collar their cat wore. They also held an annual cat festival. Number 4. In ancient Egypt, anyone found guilty of killing a cat, even accidentally, was sentenced to death. Wow, that's harsh. It was said that not even the fear which Rome inspired could save a man from this ultimate punishment. Number 5. American novelist Ernest Hemingway was also known for his collection of polydactyl, also known as six-toed cats, that still live on his estate in Key West, Florida to this day. Man, those are some really old cats. Oh, all of them are thought to be descendants of the original polydactyl cat named Snow White that was given to him by a ship captain. Now, you can't talk about cats without mentioning the mystery and legends that surround them. Number 6. You probably understand by now that the early Egyptians really loved their cats. But did you know they even worshipped cat goddesses? Uh-huh. The most notable ones were named Bastet and Mafded, and they were used for protection. Egyptians thought that Bastet manifested physically as a cat and protected Egypt from invasion, just like a cat protects its owner's home. Number 7. In China, they have a similar cat goddess named Li Shao. According to the folklore, Li Shao was given the responsibility of overseeing world affairs. But when she decided to take a nap instead, typical cat. That responsibility was then turned over to humans. Number 8. In Slavic mythology, it was believed that a barn cat named Ovenik was the protector of crops and livestock. They also said that Ovenik would even burn down the homes of any evildoers. Ah, beware the cat with matches. Number 9. Frivia, the Scandinavian goddess of the crops, rode on a chariot that was pulled by… cats. Would you think I was gonna say dogs or something? Number 10. It was only around the Middle Ages when cat folklore turned dark. During this time, cats were thought to be accomplices of witches and black magic. Number 11. The Pussy Willow got its name from yet another legend involving cats. It went something like this. A mother cat was crying near a river one day, because her kittens fell into the water and she knew she'd never be able to retrieve them. It was at this moment that some reeds bent over into the water so that the kittens could use them to climb out to safety. Ever since then, the reeds grow these velvety blooms at the top as a reward for their kind act. By the way, in case you're wondering, Pussy Galore from the James Bond movie Goldfinger had nothing to do with a cat. Number 12. 
The waving Maniki Nico cat figurines you might come across in East Asian storefronts were born from a legend about a cat at the Godokuji Temple in Japan. It was standing in the doorway of the temple watching passers-by and raised its paws at around the same time a feudal lord was walking by, seemingly calling him into the temple. As the lord entered the temple, the spot where he had been standing just moments before was struck by lightning. The lord believed that the cat saved his life, and to this day, the beckoning cat is still seen as a symbol of success and happiness, and when given as a gift, they're considered to bring good luck. Alright, cats do have a rich history in human culture, but let's move on and talk about their superpowers. From their bodies to their senses to the way they communicate, cats are truly living marvels. Number 13. You've likely heard about the knack cats have for always landing on their feet no matter how far they fall. This is called a writing reflex, and it's basically their innate ability to orient themselves as they're falling combined with their super flexible spine and collarbone. 14. Cats can't taste sweet foods, but they do have an extra organ that allows them to taste scents in the air. Apparently, that's why they stare at you sometimes with their mouths open. As in, feed me, you silly human. Number 15. Cats have outstanding balance that's only made better by their long tails. 16. A cat's whiskers are generally about the width of its body. They can use them to gauge whether or not they can fit into small spaces, which can be a matter of life or death when it comes to getting away from a predator. This is also the reason why you should never, ever cut your cat's whiskers. Number 17. Cats communicate with each other by spraying urine or scratching their claws on things in their environment. They also use vocal tones that range from light to very serious and aggressive. If they live inside, you can usually see evidence of them marking their territory on your couch, doors, curtains, and chairs. As for outdoor cats, they'll try to mark or spray their territory on trees and fences. Number 18. Cats meow only to communicate with humans. Their natural vocal range is actually inaudible to people. Whether or not they understand us when we meow back is another question entirely. Number 19. And one more note on kitty communication. Cats also use their tails to send different messages. A vibrating tail means they're happy to see you. A tail that's standing straight up with the fur completely puffed out means they're startled. It's like the human equivalent of a eek. The quintessential question mark tail means they're curious and friendly, but still just a bit hesitant. The tip twitch, meaning just the end is twitching back and forth, is usually a warning that they're starting to get agitated. The tail hug is literally just that. It's when a cat sits down beside you and literally gives you a pseudo-hug with its tail. Ah. Number 20. Cats are carnivores, which, aside from cleaning themselves, is why they have that rough, sandpaper tongue. It's supposed to help them clean every last morsel of flesh from an animal bone. 21. Cats can drink seawater. Unlike humans, cats have kidneys that can filter out the salt from seawater. 22. The ridges on a cat's nose are like fingerprints for people. That means no two kitty noses are exactly alike. 23. Kitties start to dream at about a week old. You've also probably noticed that they sleep a lot. But it's not because they're lazy. It's just that their growth hormones are only released when they're sleeping. In fact, cats spend about two-thirds of the day sleeping and about one-third of their awake time cleaning themselves. It's been calculated that cats sleep so much by the time they're 9 years old, they'll technically have only been awake for 3 years. 24. Most female cats are right-pawed, while most males are left-pawed. 25. Cats purr at a frequency of about 26 purrs per second. And 26. Cats have a homing instinct that allows them to find their way back to their familiar abode through a process called sigh traveling. 
It's even speculated that they could have magnetized brain cells that act like a compass. Just as we suspected, they're definitely light years ahead of us. It's no wonder they were worshipped by ancient Egyptians. Cats are truly wondrous little creatures, and we humans should be honored to share our lives in their presence. If you don't feel that way, <laughs> well, they definitely do. So which cat fact did you find the most surprising? Let us know down in the comments. Don't forget to give this video a like, share it with your cat-loving friends, and click subscribe to stay on the Bright Side of Life.